How's it going, y'all? My name is Cryotic Minecrafter, or Lewis, as you like to, you should call me. And today we will be doing a building tutorial on a small but yet compact house. Probably for the mic thing, I had to move it. But today I am going to show you how to build a very, very beginner type star house, and then we're gonna work up on the way you can expand it, like a bigger version each time. So what we're gonna do first off, what you're gonna need is to make it you are going to need a full stack of wood so you have a little bit extra so you know what you're doing I would not just get all you need about this I would say you just need to get a full stack of what this is and just do it the way you want it but the way I'm showing you I'm getting a full stack but I'm only gonna get one uh, you're gonna need some cobblestone you're going to need to go grit down and grab you some oak wood stairs or whatever one you would like to use some slab or whichever one you want to use and then the next thing you need to grab is fencing, a torch, lily pads, and water. Now that and that are optional. I need to do something real quick. Now, sorry, you ain't gonna be seeing my face cam because for this stuff I'm not gonna use my webcam because it's useless. What you wanna start out with is you wanna go, measure where your door's gonna be, so, there. That's where our door's gonna be, so. I'll grab a door, which other door, hmm, I'll go with jungle, why not, that there, there's your door, now see where it is, you're going to go, okay, so it's here, you need to go, that's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, out eight, wait, no, pardon me, pardon me, pardon me, it goes out to here, so it's going to be one, two, three, four, five, you go out five, but it ain't gonna be like that. You need to get yourself. We're not gonna use the lily pads right now. You're going to get yourself some oak. That's probably the most dumbest thing ever to hear. <laughs> You're gonna do that. You're gonna do the same thing. So that's one, two, three, four, five. But yeah. Now this is a small compact house, so it ain't gonna have much room really. But if you want to make it room, you can. So that's gonna be that. You're gonna go one, two, three. That's four, five, six. You're gonna go five. Now, that's how big your house is gonna be. Not a very big house, but it's a starter house. Meant for just one night at most. You're gonna fill this in with cobblestone. One, two. Make sure it's up, I believe that's at three. So it's gonna go up three. Put a piece of wood up there because that's what you're gonna be extending out to for the it's a two-story house. I'm sorry if you can hear my fan in the background, y'all. It's extremely fucking out of my room. You're gonna take wood and go all across this entire top layer. I will be back to you when this is completely done with this building setup, if you can catch my drift. I'll be back in a few seconds. Anyway, guys, it's gonna look somewhat like this. Your house is going to start out like this. I'll go around and show you. You're going to put your wall like that. You're going to put it up like behind the wood going up. That's how it's going to look like. And you should have a roof like this. But not done yet. You're going to want to take this. Go out. And go up. Like that. Break that block there and replace it with cobble. Pardon me. Cobblestone. You're doing outlining, basically, is what I like to call it. You see how I'm doing this? Wow, I just realized that's completely fucking off. Because I went to the wrong fucking area. Pardon me, y'all. I'm an idiot. I've not had much sleep. I've actually been up all damn night concentrating, doing some gaming. Uh. So it's going to roughly look something like this. So you're gonna have something roughly about this, like this, like that, and then what you'll want to do is you'll want to do this. 
just do that. Now, with that, you're going to want to get rid of certain stuff that you don't exactly need at the moment and get glass panes. Now, this can be for Xbox, PS4, PC, anything. I'm personally using PC because I like PC more than my Xbox. Fuck. You're wanting to do something like that. Now, for in here, we're going to go around uh, the same side like this. However, it's going to go uh, blocked off because you're going to have one side, you know, food, like crops and shit. And the other side, on that side, is going to be cows, all that type of stuff. Now, if you'd like to do it, you could do it the upgraded way, which by have cr uh, food down to bottom, uh, not food. Animals at the bottom, and then food at the top, like a double layer. You want to save room, which I'm gonna do for this house because it might be a lot easier for you both, for all of us actually. So what you're gonna start off with after you have that, you're gonna put your slab there and your slab there. Now you want to start at your front after you cover that in, which is just making it look a little bit nicer. See how it is right here? I'm gonna put it at this side because I don't really like it. I'll be on my right. You're gonna want to start right at that block and just keep on going this way. I feel like I just did something wrong. <laughs> uh, what are we gonna make it out of? We'll do cobblestone at the out outline. So, how big do I want? I want it about that big, not a big one. So it's gonna so look something like this, and you take your oak and go up to it. It's gonna work, look, roughly look something like this, and that's where you go to your torches and your oak fencing. You go like this. If I can get into the damn thing. So this is where your animals are going to be. Now you're probably asking yourself, hmm, how am I going to be able to get crops up top? And well, you're going to put grass down, okay? Now I'll find out how big this area is. So I'm going to go with two blocks. I'm just going to go boom, boom, down here. Then you're going to get rid of one of your torches, or the torches you have, and put water. It's going to go something like this. Now, in order to keep the animals and everything from wanting to climb up it, you're going to want to t get ready to walk water bucket for now and go and get a trap door. Or not a trap door, you just can use your slabs if you'd like. And you want to just go bloop and bloop. Just to hold it there for now. Then you can cover that up like that. Or with anything you'd like. I might have to replace it with grass. So, it's going to roughly look something like that. And now, all you want to do up here is go boop, 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 boop. Do a nice little outlining and fencing. Now, you're probably going to ask, hey, where do the torches go? It'd be helpful if I just get didn't get rid of them. You're going to want to go put one there, one there, one there, and one there. And then one in there, and if you go to the other side, you're going to do the same. One right there, one right there, one right there, and one right there. So it's all going to roughly look a little nicer. I'm going to go ahead and replace that and put it at the top. Make it look a little nicer and a little homey, if you can catch my drift. So just pretend I just put grass in there because I'm too fucking lazy to do it. <laughs> We're going to finish up with the house. But for here, you're going to go wood, wood, wood on each side, over, over, over. And you're just going to. Fill it in, get your door, and put it there. So you have a way out to your crops. And however, you are going to have to do that for the downstairs too. So we're going to put the door, this time we're going to put it that way. So it's going to look something roughly like that. Now for over here, if you want to make it look nice, put cobblestone here glass up like a boss so it's gonna look like this floor can be whatever you'd like it to be I'm gonna have it as hmm what do I want it to be I'm gonna have it sandstone because I do like I do like a sandstone it is a nice 
Now, the fun part begins. This has been almost over, maybe about 20 minutes of a video just because it's cut up. So I thought Echo was a little batty. I'm in a new room again. So. But it's going to want to be somewhat nice, if you can catch my drift. You want it to be really nice. So it's going to make it look, I guess you can say, more housey. So that's how it's going to look. If you'd like to do it like a nice little front, you could go... Like that. Make it look a little nicer. Which I'm going to do. Now, let's just continue with this. We can go do glass all around it. If you'd like to do just one area of glass and one not, go right ahead. No one is stopping you. I think what I'll do for this side is I'll also just put up some cobblestone. So it's going to roughly look something, 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 very much, very much like this. Unless you want to get rid of the sandstone. Now the roofing is where the fun begins. You're going to want to have your staircase. You're going to go out like that. But make sure you curt like that. God damn it. And just do that same thing over here. Then you're gonna go up. Curve it. You're gonna do the exact same for over here. And you're probably sitting there saying, hey, Lewis, why would we do this to make our house look ugly? It's not making your house look ugly, it's the way the roof has to be put. Make it look nice. Now, you could do any roof the way you like it, but the reason I'm saying do a roof like this is because it makes it look like a proper, like a little cabin type of thing. Now, this is just a starter house. Like, literally, this is a starter's house. Nothing, like, really too hard about this. You can make this under, like, maybe ten minutes at least. But I'm taking my time because I'm not a rusher unless I'm playing like proper survival and I need to get shit done before nighttime. Now, make it as tall as you want. I'm gonna make it to the wet pointy, like a pointy type roof. Which is gonna take a little while and I'm not I'm really good at doing time lapsing, so I won't do a time lapse. I'm just gonna show you how to do it. And yeah, that may sound like an idiot. I don't know how to time lapse. Oh yeah, I'd like to do a little bit of a shouting, shouting why I'm doing this. I would like to shout out a few of my good friends. One is Ghost Clips. If you don't know who he is, he is a montager where he does nothing but like black ops, like black ops, like really cool, like trick shotting type montages. And I support for what he does. He does really damn good at it, even though he may, 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 may suck sometimes. He has his moments where he is literally a star and I want to support him as much as I could. He's a nice guy. I mean, fuck. If I could shoot as good as he would, fuck, man. I'd be perfect. My trick shotting skills play fucking shitty. And I mean very fucking shitty. Now, I said I was gonna point it, but I think I'm gonna stop it there. What you're gonna do is you wanna go like this. Like that. And for look... going to want to do that and then you're going to do that 
Now, what, the reason I'm doing it like this is because this entire area is going to be filled with glowstone. Or anything else that you want, you'd like to light up. I'm in, currently in 1.8 because I like I like 1.8 more than 1.11. But this is not going to be a room unless you want to make it to a room, which is totally up to you. But if you want to do it the way I'm doing it, make sure you fill this entire goddamn area with glowstone or something. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to go and grab me the glowstone. And I'm also, also going to grab me a sea lantern. So I'm just going to go like this the entire way. Now, it roughly should look something about like this. Which, if you'd like to do what I'm about to do, take your thing and go like this. Like that. Now, under this, if you want to make it look proper, pull out your fencing. Make sure you still have, you still cap your glowstone. Break that, pull that out, go out two, and then go down one. And then put either glowstone or sea lantern. I'm doing glowstone. Now, to finish it all off, you're going to want to furnish it however you would like. But if you want to make it the way I'm trying to do it, make sure you get some trap doors. And you dang well know what you're doing. Uh, bloop, 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 and motherfudging. Bloop, bloop, and uh, bloop. So it's going to roughly look something like this. I am going to leave it at that. Make a pole going down off it because that's what I want to do. And now, if you'd like a little, like a little porch, all you have to do, get rid of one item, and all you have to do is get yourself a slab of mini soil. I'm going to use spruce this time, just mix it up a little bit. All is done. This is how it's roughly going to look like. Do what you need to do here. So that, my friends, is how I would build a nice starter house. Obviously, you fill it all up and everything. I would make it like this because it makes it makes it feel like a big house, but it ain't too big. Now, please give me at least one or two likes if you'd like to see more of this stuff. I might do a mansion or something, like a really dope, cool mansion. If you only want it. This has been a hell of a banger. Hopefully... Thank you guys, and please, please go subscribe to Mr. Ghost Clips, Austin Killer 5000. Links, both their channels will be in my description. Go check them out, give them some love, and say the L Squad sent you there. Goodbye, y'all, and as always, stay like a mother.